Hi, and welcome back to my channel, where every day we explore the beauty and wonder of God's creation. Today we take a fascinating journey into the world of elands, the majestic and awe-inspiring creatures that roam the African plains. Join me as we delve into the spiritual lessons we can learn from these magnificent creatures. Elands are known for their imposing size and strength, yet they remain humble, often grazing peacefully alongside other animals. In Philippians 2 verses 3 to 4, the Bible reminds us, do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit. Rather, in humility, value others above yourselves, not looking to your interests but each of you to the interests of the others. Elans teach us that true strength lies in humility and respect for others, as we should put others' interests before our own. Elans are renowned for their patience, waiting for the right moments to graze or drink. Just like these creatures, the Bible in Romans 12 verse 12 encourages us to be patient in our hope, enduring in times of trouble. It teaches us to persevere, knowing that waiting can lead to the most rewarding outcomes. Elands form tight-knit family groups and herds, where they protect and support one another. This reflects the biblical teaching found in Proverbs 17 verse 17, a friend loves at all times, and a brother is born for a time of adversity. Elands remind us of the importance of strong family bonds and loyal friendships that help us navigate life's challenges. Elands rely on the strength of their herd to deter predators. Similarly, the Bible in Ecclesiastes 4 verse 12 teaches that, though one may be overpowered, two can defend themselves. A cord of three strands is not quickly broken. Elands show us the power of unity in working together, emphasizing that we are stronger when we stand as one. Elands are known for their resourcefulness in finding food and water in the African savanna. Proverbs 6 verses 6 to 8 says, Go to the ant, you sluggard, consider its ways and be wise. It has no commander, no overseer or ruler, yet it stores its provisions in summer and gathers its food at harvest. Elands remind us of the importance of resourcefulness and the need to prepare for the future by wisely managing our resources. Elands typically graze on the abundance provided by nature without seeking more than they need. Similarly, in 1 Timothy 6 verse 6, we are advised that godliness with contentment is great gain. Elands encourage us to find contentment in what we have, rather than constantly pursuing material possessions. Elands are resilient animals, known for surviving in challenging environments. In James 1 verse 12, we find the encouragement, Blessed is the one who perseveres under trial because, having stood the test, that person will receive the crown of life that the Lord has promised to those who love him. Elands teach us the value of resilience, that in enduring challenges, we may find ultimate rewards. Finally, Elands are symbols of freedom, gracefully moving across the open plains. In Galatians 5 verse 1, we read, It is for freedom that Christ has set us free. Stand firm, then, and do not let yourselves be burdened again by a yoke of slavery. Elands inspire us to embrace our freedom in Christ and to not be entangled by worldly burdens. Elands, with their majesty and grace, provide us with profound object lessons that echo the wisdom found in the Bible. I hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new. Hopefully these lessons will inspire you to live more purposefully and harmoniously with the world around you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share for more content on the beauty and wonder of God's creation. Comment below and let me know what object lessons we can learn from Elance and which animal you would like me to discuss. Thanks for watching.